number three. On the 2nd of May 2006, children playing found the body at the foot of the Oosterschlauder. Research in the Netherlands has yielded nothing for the time being. That is why they are now looking for people who knew the man. This is a man who is probably between 40 and 50 years old, of a normal build and was between 170 and 180 centimetres tall. Forensic research shows that he had been dead for no longer than one year when he was found. The man probably disappeared in the spring of 2005 and he must certainly be missed by someone. He wore a brown woolen sweater with striking motifs, a short leather jacket with a vertically striped inner lining and grey or beige trousers in a fine checked pattern. A lemon and soda brand label was also found near the body that almost certainly comes from one of the pieces of clothing and possibly a landmark. The man had a key bag with the advertisement for a company from Zolder in Limburg. This company no longer exists, but the key bag is so unique that researchers think that the man must have come from Belgium. One of the three keys contains the inscription BEVI. This led investigators to a company in Vendina. They confirmed that the key was made at their place. It's probably a key to a mailbox in Vendina. Perhaps the man came from the region or simply stayed on the Belgian coast for a while. Number two. On Sunday the 15th of July 2012, a nasty discovery was made in Rheinbach, Germany. The lifeless body of a newborn baby boy was found at 5.30pm. The police are trying to identify the child and the parents. The baby was found in a parking lot along the highway A61 E31 between Cobbs Lens and Cologne. The mother may be from Belgium. There is a good chance that it concerns a girl or woman who has not enthusiastically shared her pregnancy with people around her. She may have even hidden the pregnancy. The German police are looking for possible witnesses. Anyone who stopped on Sunday the 15th of July at the Peppenhoven Oost car park A61 E31 in the direction of Arhen. There is a gas station, a highway restaurant and a parking area where motorists can take a break. Maybe someone saw a strange person or noticed a suspicious vehicle. If you think you knew someone who was heavily pregnant before the 15th of July and then does not have a baby, please contact the police. Number one. Police are looking for the identity of a woman who was found dead in the border region at the beginning of 2013. On Sunday the 6th of January, the remains of an unknown woman were found on the banks of the Mass at the Peter Plas near Maastricht, Netherlands. The investigation shows that she had been in the water for a long time and has not yet been identified. This concerns a woman who is younger than 40 years old. She is 170 centimetres tall and has noticeably small feet, shoe size 35. She has uncapped teeth with many fillings. The woman was wearing jewellery that someone might recognise, a silver coloured bar in her tongue piercing, a ring with a pendant in the shape of a fish with a brown rotating stone, a silver coloured ring with a stone with the inscription stainless steel on the inside, a silver coloured necklace with the inscriptions on the links SL, stainless steel and two arrows, a wristwatch with steel bracelet brand Q&Q. If you think you know this woman or you know more about the jewellery, please do not hesitate to contact the investigators. <laughs>